Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Georgia, so today I'm really excited because, you know, I'm back. I mean, it hasn't been that long, it's only been like eight days, but today, you know, I've woken up, I'm in a really good mood. It's a sunny day in England, which is obviously always really shocking, and, you know, it's just put me in a nice, happy mood. Now, today I'm going to be reacting to something that, you know, has been done, like, that was done like years ago and it was recommended to me by my dad because you know he knows that I like the kind of like dancey stuff. So I'm reacting to River Dance at the Eurovision Song Contest the 30th of April 1994 in Dublin. Now I wasn't even alive in 1994 you know, and I wasn't even alive until 2002 so you know that it was out for quite a few years before I was ever born and you know I'm 20 now nearly 21 and you know this will, will be my first time seeing this which is crazy because according to my dad it's all famous and popular and whatever but yeah I will be reacting to it I love dance and I thought you know what I will watch a bit of dance because well, I mean it's river dance so I don't know really know what style that is so I thought you know what I will give that a watch because I like any dance so yeah let's get on with the video <laughs> And now, my friends, River Dance, a full-bodied orchestral dance piece composed by Bill Whelan, involving traditional Irish dancers, the Celtic Choir Anuana, and the magical dance partnership of Jean Butler and Michael Flatley. Ladies, Ladies and, and gentlemen, gentlemen River, River Dance. dance. say like I love anything to do with like singing and like that choir kind of sound it's a lot of, like an operatic sound isn't it if that's like the word to use but I feel like I've always really liked it because and very clever to put it at the start because it really brings you in and like makes you feel a type of way like if I want to listen to it I'm like oh my god like it, it makes you feel emotions and I don't know how and I don't know why but something about hearing that sound like the operatic kind of choir sound makes you just feel a type of way and feel emotional and it you know it sets a nice tone and like sort of eerie do you know what I mean like serene and I kind of like it so yeah <laughs>
that that is what you call making an entrance. Now, one thing I love about stage stuff, especially dance, is when there's a an amazing, just an amazing entrance. Do you know what I mean? Like that guy, he really swooped in, did his tap in. Can I say, I love the outfit. Looks very piratey, looks like a bit like a pirate. But do you know what, can I just say so far, it's very, very impressive. The woman looked very elegant, and now that guy came in looking really cool, and the music is sick, and it's also cool, and I'll comment it all at the end, because I don't want to ramble too much during the video, but it's so cool. <laughs> duet moment i love a duet you know like just a man and a woman dancing together i love it so like i love the energy of it i just love how it works and it's great and can i say the the beats like the the feet tapping being on time with the beat is fantastic the the straight legs are very straight like that is impressive and can i say when they came in the line the synchronicity is amazing like you know i don't want to gas it up too much but it's great like it's actually so good i'm so impressed okay so basically that's the thing with watching things like that i'm like i need to get the full thing pretty much watched without pausing too much because i want to like get the full thing in its flow do you know what i mean but can i just say wildly wildly impressive now the thing is i do acting but i love anything to do with any of the arts like i love dancing i love singing i love acting it's just i can only really do acting i can't sing and i can't dance so when i watch it and i see the pure talent that dancers have i'm flabbergasted like i am flabbergasted can i say the synchronicity for one they must have practiced that for months and if they didn't 
kudos to them. The thing is, and that guy, right, I'll talk about the man and the woman. Basically, the woman, when she came out, looked very elegant. She's very tall, very just elegant when she's doing it, and that's why it looks very pretty. But the thing is with the guy, when he came out, he looked like a cool pirate, you know? And then he was tapping away with his straight legs and kicking it up in the air, and then, you know, he was he was doing the whole thing with the drums, and then, like, with him, I like the battle. That was, was so cool. Like, whoever thought of that, if he thought of that, that is so cool. His stage presence, second to none. Like, I found myself constantly wanting to watch him because his facial expressions, he looked so happy. His, the way he danced, like his stage presence is second to none. Like that is the, that is what you want as an actor, especially as well. Like, do you want to have good stage presence in any of the arts? So well done, mate. You have stage presence nailed. The whole like chorus and the ensemble, you know, that was amazing because they were all in sync. Do you know what I mean? Like even though they didn't have their main roles, they still made sure they were in sync and like perfect and beautiful. And it was just great to watch. Very, and the music, they went with the music. The music was amazing. I feel like music always really sets the tone. Like that's why music is needed because it sets the tone for what you're watching. But yeah, before I ramble on too much about this, because like, you know, I did't know huge about Riverdance and you know how it's supposed to be, but great straight legs, great pointed toes, very poised. I liked his arm movements with his like, kicking his feet and tapping his feet that looked really cool because you know it added like some flair and some character and I liked that you know he was just great you know he had a great character and I felt like in terms of him he felt like he was carrying the story and I liked that because I liked the woman but she kind of just brought like the good technical skills and like elegance and then he came out and he really like characterized it and I appreciated that but yeah let me stop rambling about that because it was just so good I can't help myself but yeah if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up please subscribe and please turn on the notification bell goodbye